Peace, blessings. Appreciate you for clicking on this video. Hit the like, support the platform. You heard? Bellas, we got to do better, man. For real. Like, it's not worth it. I promise you it's not worth it. Not only did these two brothers cross the line, but they weren't thinking about the consequences to their actions. I don't know what went through their mind, dog. I don't, they first names, I'm not going to say they first names, but I'll say Williams and Allen. 121, 119, these dudes got arrested for kidnapping a woman, right? So what happened was the woman entered a gas station and they started catcalling, trying to hit on her, get her attention. You know, they were interested, you know, they basically were hitting on, obviously they were hitting on her. Well, literally hitting on her, right? She rejected she rejected the advances. Moments later, they grabbed Shorty, threw her in the trunk. She managed to escape. Right? She managed to escape. And they were arrested by deputies and marshals for the kidnapping. They're being held in, you know, being held right now without bond, facing some felony kidnapping charges. And this whole situation had went viral on Twitter. A lot of women chimed in on the situation, you know, saying that, you know, it's a shame that if a woman tells a man, no, this is what can happen to you. It shouldn't happen, but there are niggas out there who will do that some worse. The thing that's crazy to me, number one, rejection is a part of being an adult. In the dating game, that's something we all got to be fine with. You know what I'm saying? Hell, you, man, you know, people need to start looking at it from the point of, hell, you might be better off without the person who rejected to you. Think about it that way. You know what I'm saying? But more important than that, these brothers just, I don't know what they was thinking, man. It's like it only took them a split second to think to themselves, oh, let's kidnap this girl. Let's throw her in the trunk. Because she said no. I couldn't fathom thinking some shit like that, dog. Because you not, cause now we talking about you being in a place where you ain't going to never be able to hit on no female ever again. As a matter of fact, you're not going to ever see one. At least for a long time. You heard? You're not even going to be in a position to holler at a female now. There's too many women out here to even think about some shit like that, dog. <laughs> the thing that stuck in my mind is how quick it took them to come up with the idea to even do some shit like that. All in all, y'all threw your life away over the word no. Maybe there was a way that she said it. Maybe she was rude about it or whatever. But then again, catcalling isn't exactly the most respectful way to catch someone's eye. You know what I'm saying? No matter what the case, ain't no man or female, especially that you don't know, that you have no feelings over, It that is never worth it. Doing time. Taking a penitentiary chance. So I definitely can't feel sorry for these brothers, man. They real young, too. But you would think they're at least old enough to understand that, right? Evidently not. In conclusion, ladies, be careful. And to my fellas, I would like to think that at least the majority of the men in the world are smart enough to not even come up with this idea, fam. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. <laughs> Hit that like. Support the platform. I'd appreciate that. Peace and blessings. I'm out.